Hello, hello, hello. Well, Santa has been early for me this year as uh, he dropped off this nice wee white thing. And uh, most people will recognize this as being the AirPod Pro uh, charging case. And uh, we open it up and reveal the uh, AirPod Pro themselves. I, I am, if anybody watches my channel, they will have seen at some point, <coughs> if they were interested, of course, I did a review on the original uh, first gen AirPods. And uh, although skeptical at first before I tried them, and uh, I did make an apology to Apple that uh, they were actually really pretty good. And they still are good, even though the second generation brought in what, like, wireless charging case. Um, but the 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 sound from the first generation uh i thought was uh, really good now the problem for me with the first generation is the problem for many people is about the the looseness of the fit in the ear this is typical of all uh, um, uh, uh, apple's earphones um you do not get a, a real good, a good closure so you get a lot of uh, ambient noise and it kind of ruins the for me anyway, it ruins the whole music experience. Uh, that is completely um, gone with the uh, AirPod uh, Pro. Um, so some of the spec on them seemingly has the same chip, H1 chip. Uh, it is IPX4, uh, sweat and slightly water resistant. They say for 4.5 hours with transparency or noise cancellation, and that's a big thing, and I'll get onto that in a minute. Five hours without it, probably you get a wee bit more. Um, and I'm just looking here to see if there's anything else. Uh, um, of course, the biggest thing, um, active noise cancellation, and, and they do this obviously because these don't look like your normal kind of Apple fare. Um, when it comes to f going into your ear, as you can see, these really go into your ear canal. You get uh, different si sizes of uh, the um, ear tips here, so you can really uh, see which are best fit for you. And you um, really do get brilliant, for me, I would consider a brilliant uh, active noise cancellation. Now, I sold my uh, I sold my iPhone ten, um, and people might think, well, why are you spending one thousand six one thousand sixty rials on somebody you don't have an iPhone? Well, I do have an iPhone. I have the iPhone SE. Now, if you ha if you're coming from Apple iPhone and you have all of that good stuff, then these are very easy to set up. Everything pairs very quickly you can do a fit test and it will tell you if it's if you've got the right uh, approximate the right ear tips in your ear canals uh, so that you get the best out of this noise cancellation um, there's also this thing called transparency that gives you a bit of uh, I think it means that it gives you a bit of noise cancellation but it's still you can hear kind of ambient and noise around you but it's not that um, uh, noisy uh, that's what I'm um, to understand now uh, of course this case is you can charge wirelessly uh, slightly um, smaller than the I, I AirPod first gen case but it's a bit wider and uh, the, also the other difference with um, these is that uh, maybe not be able to see it here but here are you can press down on these um, on both uh, both AirPods and you can use these for a number of uh, actions like skipping tracks, uh, cycling through your um, uh, music, uh, um, stuff like that. Uh, you, you can kind of uh, change what they do as well. Now for the most part I'm using these on non, uh, non uh, Apple uh, uh, devices and here uh, I'm just going to show you this, there's a thing called Assistant Trigger. This is an app on Android and it gives you some um, bits of um, function that you can use and it seems to work alright. It's not anywhere near what you can use the uh, the 
if you have an iPhone, but it's okay. Uh, and really, these pair very easily with every Android device that I've used, my uh, and even my Windows, uh, the Samsung tablet that I have. So they paired with uh, Samsung tablet, other Samsung tablet, a number of Android phones, no problem whatsoever. And you can. Uh, change the settings by clicking on uh, the stems and uh, that will cycle you through I think is uh, transparency and noise cancellation and off for the, the uh, uh, noise cancellation now um, the noise cancellation I, I, I've I have never had over ear uh, noise cancelling headphones um, which I suppose will be the best type of noise cancellation but uh, I have had in-ear uh, noise cancellation and uh, these uh, AirPod Pro they are I think do an absolutely brilliant job now you will, you can hear in the background the AC fan and uh, something that many people complain about but I don't have any control over and I'm too lazy to fix a mic although I might try I have a mic somewhere and I might try a mic um, but yeah you know my problem is lazy itis uh, anyway you hear that AC when I put these in my ear, uh, I put the first one in, still hear an AC, and as soon as I put the second one in, boom, um, you hear nothing, and then you're ready for all that good music. So uh, the the quality of the music uh, or the sound, sorry, is I don't think is any different from the original first gen. I think just because of the in ear and also because of the noise cancellation, I like the sound of the first gen. Um, I, I, you know, for me, it, it, it ticked all the boxes. wasn't bassy, uh, um, was pretty bright, and really there was a lot of separation. And I just think, as a kind of general, um, uh, kind of one size fits all sound, I think they're really good. Now, initially, I was not going to buy these. I was going to look at the Sony. Uh, uh, they have. Um, uh, a pair of around about the same price uh, wireless earbuds that are have active noise cancellation and they kind of get reviewed with the AirPod Pro uh, kind of head to head kind of thing so I was really considering them and they're a wee bit cheaper um, because of my preference for Android but my wife went ahead and, and got me these and you know I'm, I'm happy I think they are really good now um, a standout feature is for me as well is the quality of the uh, microphone when you're in ear and uh, you know you're taking a call I think it's really good uh, you can um, on Android you can stop the tracks uh, with your uh, that a trigger assistant um, so you get uh, um, a bit of functionality uh, but what it all comes down to for the most part is the um, sound now these will make great in these also make great kind of um, in ear monitors as well, I think they fit really well. They're a lot less, uh, <coughs> excuse me, obtrusive than the. As you can see, the stem is a lot shorter, so they're a lot less uh, intrusive than the original uh, AirPod. And uh, anybody with a, a wee bit of hair hanging over their ear, I mean, that could be covered. That you wouldn't know uh, you had an earphone in. So, um, I think the. Um, serve a lot of purposes and really should not be overlooked by Android people as well if they fancy them because for the most part nearly everything that you get there's certain things that you might not be getting um, but for the most part if it's to do with sound to do with playing music taking calls and having that active noise cancellation you, you can you can get all that with an Android device so um, you know you, something to consider now is it worth that price well, I'm not sure. Uh, of course, uh, Apple always a bit more expensive. I prefer it to be around the same price as the Sony, which I see here is around about 900, 850, that kind of price. I think it would be more kind of on the money. Uh, but Apple, you always have to pay a bit of a premium. I've had no problems with the, um, what do you call it, the uh, wireless charging. And I suppose now that I've paired them with that iPhone SE that I have, I don't carry it with me all the time, but uh, it's in the house. Uh, you can use if you lose one. And my kid is always trying to grab these. 
he's all you know it's, it's constantly having to hide them and before with my old airpods he had grabbed them and and uh, they separated both of them but luckily we had the find the airpod thing which uh, if as long as they have a charge that is they will beep a sound um so uh, for iphone uh users more functionality siri integration that kind of thing but <clears throat> for general purpose bluetooth you i had no problems whatsoever um you just prep for um pairing there's a button here it's the same as the original um airpods you just press here until the green light here there's a green light as you can see if i open this here um when the, that green light you uh, press and it will turn uh, white and start flashing and it should be picked up by you know your whatever device you are so i had no problems at all um battery life ec <laughs> excellent again like the original ones i use these when i'm lying in bed watching some whatever football on or something on my tablet in bed and they're really very very light so you don't notice um that after a while you really don't notice that they're there and plus uh, with that noise cancellation gives you a bit more of an immersive kind of um experience shall we say so uh, i just think they're a wee bit overpriced but i really do rate them and for people who don't who really like their music like me but not necessarily an audiophile um uh, these are a plenty good uh, and um, definitely uh, worth considering should you have the budget i, I would say it's a no-brainer if you have an iphone uh, but if you're not too bothered about the active noise cancellation and you're not bothered about the uh, wireless charging you know, try and pick up the first generation airpods they're still really good so um, that's all I really wanted to share with you that, that my experience with these now has been really good and I would say my favourite thing is the noise cancellation I just think it is it's is, it is pretty decent although I'm not saying I haven't had a lot to compare it to but I just think it is really good and it does cancel the noise so it does say um, it does do what it says on the tin so that's my piece on the AirPods Pro and any questions or comments etc etc um you can leave them at the bottom and i will do my best to uh answer them in a timely fashion so thank you bye